Good morning, this is Bernie Lodge with the Intermountains Emergency Disaster Services. Today we're going to go through a 72 hour bag or a go bag. Disaster season's upon us, wildfires, floods, tornadoes, they can happen at any time, usually the most inconvenient time. So having a 72 hour bag at your disposal will increase or will actually decrease your response time. As volunteers, we need to be ready to go. Go bags are very similar to a camping bag. In mine, I keep gloves, pens, notepads, a couple of flashlights, and spare batteries, and a multi-tool. For camping, I keep a hammock, hammock straps, and a hammock cover. Um, never know exactly where I'm going to end up sleeping. I have all of the USB and other gadgets I need for my electronics, paracord, extra charger, sharpies. I have a towel along with shower shoes. Enough branded shirts and t-shirts to keep me going for three or four days along with reading materials for whatever downtime I can get extra shirts underwear socks try to keep those in small kits so when I go to the showers or change, I just grab one roll. Toiletry items. Ensure that you have any medications that you need to take. Along with extra pants. As well as shorts and extra sleeping attire. I also keep with me a water bottle. Ensure that you stay hydrated. A first aid kit, tourniquet, and bandana, along with medical shears. A small camera for recording the event. You can also use the camera on your phone. and credentials that you might need. So this is what's in the 72 hour bag. It's enough clothes, toiletries, hygiene items, and other gear to get me through the next 72 hours or the first 72 hours in a disaster. So please take the time to get your go bags ready. And please share with us what you have in your go bags. And for more information on volunteering, please contact us via the website and follow us on our social media pages.